don't know if you guys can see me. Hi guys, welcome to um another video. Um today I don't have my um sidekick or my partner today with me, so um bear with me. I'm just gonna show you guys how I make my um Dr. Sebi Dr. Sebi somebody corrected me says that Dr. Dr. Sebi. Dr. Sebi approved chickpea stew. Everything I'm gonna use is gonna be Dr. Sebi approved and it's gonna be real simple. Alright, I'm just gonna show you what I have already. I have a pan already, I'm just gonna ooh, that's and I have my peppers. I just cut I cut up some peppers and, and onions and tomatoes and I'm gonna roast them in the oven. If you can, I don't know if you can see I'm just gonna I'm gonna put it on it and I'll just show you. This camera, it is what it is for now. Uh see I'll put it in the pan just like this. I'll put some grape seed oil. I'm going to put like a, a tablespoon of grape seed oil and I'm going to put some sea salt, about a quarter tablespoon, a quarter teaspoon of sea salt, let's not, let me not mis, mis, inform you, alright, so I'm just going to stir it, just mix it all together, this is, this is it. I'm just, I'm going to stick it in the oven. I'm going to stick it in the oven for 15 minutes. And then I'm going to show you what we're going to do with it when we come back. Okay. Um, this is, this is what it looks like roasted. It's a little char, or I don't know how to say it. It's a little char, but I, where I'm from, that's called flavor. If you can see this, can you see? Yeah, it's all nice and roasted. So now I'm just going to put everything together. I'm going to put this on the foil. I'm going to add it to my blender. I think this blend is the most used thing in my house. I just dumped everything in here. I'm going to add one habanero, dry habanero pepper. I'm going to add one more tablespoon of, um, of grapeseed oil. And I'm just going to blend everything together. Mm. of it. Uh, this is the consistency of, of it. I think I'm going to make it blend a little bit. I want it to be a little, a little bit more fine. That's perfect. Now this is what it looks like. Alright, I'm just going to add everything to a pot. I'm going to move the camera around so you guys can see. Uh, yeah, that's still, still over there. Um, let's close this because I'm cooking quinoa on the side. I just want to have too many things going on. Alright, I just turn up the, I just turn off my, turn on my stove. This is the blended, um, I'm going to add it to the pot, if you can see. I'm going to get everything out. I'm using one hand. So. And I already have, I already have some, I already have some chickpeas that I already cooked. So I'm just going to add the chickpea in there. Maybe half of it. Um, I, I already cooked like two cups of um, chickpeas earlier in my pressure cooker because I like my chickpea, chickpea, um, my chickpea really soft. All right, so I'm just going to, I'm going to, I'm going to mix everything together. This is a little, I'm going to mix everything together and I'm just going to let it cook for about 
five minutes just so everything's sitting there and simmer and blending together I'm gonna add a uh, a tea, uh, maybe half a teaspoon of salt and maybe some thyme and it should be ready and I'm gonna show you what it looks like when it's ready okay uh, welcome back guys um it's ready I hate the fact that I can't show you on the stove but this is it it's cooked I'm just gonna dish it put it in the plate and this is what it looks like I hope you guys can see it this is what it looks like the all the um this is the stew chickpeas chickpeas stew Dr. Sebi approved. Everything in here is Dr. Sebi approved. So, if you try it and you like it, uh, make sure you comment below. Um, if you want to see more videos, want to see, see me do more um, cooking, mm, so good. I have some quinoa that I made earlier. I'm just going to add some to it. Just so we balance out the milk. Put in my quinoa. I'm just gonna eat that, and that's my dinner. Dr. Savvy approved. Delicious, delicious, very simple to make. If you have any questions, make sure you um leave them below. Um, comment, thumbs up, subscribe. Make sure you subscribe. Thank you, thank you, thank you for watching. Um, I'm gonna see you on the on the next video. Hopefully, my partner in crime will be back by then. Thank you again, and you have a good day. Bye.